guys, welcome back to my uh, Fallout 3 Let's Play. Let's get back into it. We're gonna be exploring Megaton and deciding the fate of Megaton, pretty much. Holy Jesus, it's bright out here. I forgot how bright it is. Okay. Jesus, my. Volume's really loud right now. Keep that up. these weapons get them all in order got so much stuff in the vault oh, I need a higher repair skill for most starting in the game so I should probably do get that up there 30 uh, speech of 40 oh actually I'm gonna need I'm gonna need 50 speech megaton Black Widow right now, but that's a really important skill to have. Especially that I'm a girl and there's mostly guys in the wasteland. Most raiders are guys and most most main characters are guys. That's why it's good to have a girl as a character. Uh, what am I looking for? Oh yeah, I gotta change my shirt. Frag grenades, awesome. Pretty sure there's a skill book in one of these mailboxes, though. Thought it was that one. I know there's a skill book. Here comes the DLC raid, it's just gonna flood right in. Oh, there's a skill book. Who is there? I never went in this basement before. I don't know if anybody knows. Like, uh, leave a comment if you know what's down there, because I've never went down there before. I have no idea how to get down there. Make a ton. We go to Megaton. What's going on, man? Please help me. I need water. What you want? I'm dying. Ready, right, gotcha. You are you serious? I, I can't offer anything <coughs> in exchange, you know. I, I can just have it. I can just have it. Yeah, you can have it, man. Here you go. My thank you. Thank you so much. You've saved my life. Bless you. Welcome to Megaton. Bye -bye. Have well. yourself a nice day. Usually there's a merchant here, but I, really won't, I was really hoping he was going to be here. So I can sell all my vault suits and batons. I'll 
be dead. Another newcomer. Name's Lucas Sims, town sheriff, and mayor too, when the need arises. I don't know why, but I like you, girl. Something tells me you're all right. So welcome to Megaton. Just holla if you need something. Alright, I'll holler at you there, Sheriff. Friendly and well-mannered. I think we're gonna get along just fine. You treat my people nice, and you're welcome to stay as long as you'd like. Let my people go! I'm glad we understand each other. Now, is there something I can help you with? No, I don't think so. Nope, sorry. I got enough fires to put out in this place that I don't have time to keep tabs on every visitor. I'd ask around town. Oh yeah, I'll get right to that, man. God, with this bomb business. I don't trust any of the locals to tinker with it. Besides, most people don't even realize it's still a threat. I don't know whether and I hell, should... Cromwell and those crazies from the Church of Adam, they worship the damn thing. Or help Why? them. Why? You think you got the know-how to disarm it? For good? Oh, all right. I'm probably just going to disarm it, because I've listen here. I already had a playthrough when I was younger. If you get the job done, blowing up Megaton, it's really not worth it. Kind of, you kind of end up regretting it later. Not an option. I'm. Oh man. All right, what's on your? I need that extra caps. I should have put on. Uh, I should have put this. Alt 101 jumpsuit on. Would have probably got that speech. He is coming with the cloud. The glow. And every eye the glow. Will be blind with his glory. Every ear. Who have we here? Confessor With Cromwell. A new addition to our humble little community? Yes. Dear child, welcome. Welcome to Megaton. I am Confessor Cromwell, prophet of Atom and father of the Undying Glow. Please, child, come to the church anytime, anytime at all. Many of the transient visitors Guy's so creepy. One of Megaton's seedier establishments. I suggest you speak to Colin Moriarty. What kind of drugs are you on, Confessor uh, Cromwell? Tell me, who'd you get it from? Yes, what would you like? Those who were called to Atom during the Great Division were very fortunate. They were permitted to aid in the process of Atom's creation. We seek the same, both in symbol and in fact. And the bomb, as you call it, represents Adam's capacity for creation. We kneel before it and ask that Adam call us to aid him. We pray that out of our meager bodies, he will create new life. I really don't the think you seek the same the there, of buddy. Atom is based on the idea that each single atomic mass in all of creation contains within it an entire universe. Oh my god, this when guy is crazy. When that atomic mass is split, a single universe divides and becomes two, thus signifying the single greatest act of Atom's creation. Occasionally, a divine event occurs, and trillions upon trillions of new universes are created. The last such event took place here, 200 years ago, where most of the lost children of Atom see that event as simple war and devastation. We see creation and unification in Atom's glow. Even knowing the truth, you continue to. Mock. I can't remember when Fallout 3 oh, takes place. Very sad. I think it's actually after Fallout 4. As you wish. Or I think New Vegas is after Fallout 4. 
I'm not gonna donate to him. I don't have any money. News? My friend, I take effort not to be involved in such worldly business. Of course, now that you mentioned it, I've noticed that Moira has hired a mercenary to protect her. In my youth, I traveled quite a bit, but that was a different life. I assume that you are seeking information and advice, yes? The only advice that I can offer is this. You will find no wealth in the wasteland greater than that which you will find within yourself. Uh, that's like the best advice I've ever got in my life. Okay, I'm done talking to you. You want something? Let's go to the bar. Oh, there. oh my god, let me jump. It's so hard to... Alright, that was a fail. Guess we'll just walk around the bar. We'll send to the bar, boys. What do you guys think? Send or what? Moriarty Saloon. Ah, come on, you piece of junk. Every day it's the same damn thing. I know who you I told are. You, Bob, it ain't the radio. The Enclave Station comes in fine. Colin Moriarty, at your service. Colin Moriarty. My saloon. My <laughs> Look at the goal. He always like so zoned right out. Bird. You've got the caps. I've got Take your out of it. Please sit down, make yourself comfortable. Your troubles are a thing of the past. Oh, I'm sure they're a thing of the past. My God, it's you. The little baby girl all grown up. Persistent little flower, ain't you? Then and now it would seem. It's been a long time, kid. Oh, your daddy passed through here all right. Here and gone. Got what he came for and then left. I'm assuming you'll do the same, correct? I don't know. Maybe you just tell me where he is. Is that what your father told you? That you were born in that hole? That he was born there as well? Oh, the lies we tell to those we love. Your father brought you to the vault right after you were born. To keep you safe, you see. I remember it well. You stayed in my saloon, after all. That's right. Your father, his brotherhood a steel friend, and you, the suckling babe with nary a tit to suckle. Sorry about your mom, truly. Ah, but life goes on. Daddy lied. Life's full of little disappointments. And now you're all grown up and wondering where he's gone to. Ah, I see. You know, I heard about the brainwashing that goes on down there. From some other fella, escaped. Oh, five years back. All hail the overseer. We're born in the vault. We die in the vault and all that other assorted lunacy. Kid, you've got better programming than our own deputy weld. You'd best wise up quick. Wouldn't want anyone taking advantage of you, hmm? Did he? Well, our time together was brief, but that is the way of it out here. When a bond is forged, little else matters, hmm? Well, he did come through here, but he left. I'm truly sorry. It, but maybe you can catch up to him. He headed southeast into the city. Said he needed information from those lonies at the station. You know, Galaxy News Radio. What there is of it. I own a saloon, kid. Rumors are part and parcel. So, I'll give you this one for free. Not sure if you've met her, but... Lucy West, that pretty young thing? She's afraid. Of what? Of who? I couldn't say. But you can feel the fear on her. Galaxy News Radio is some loudmouth radio station located in the ruins of DC. Three Dog, the king of that loony bin, keeps yapping about fighting some good fight or something. A bunch of crap. But I suppose if you wanted to know what was going on in the wasteland, that's the place to go. Me, I could care less. And so now we part. It's Galaxy News. 
There's the... Hey, smooth skin. You need something? A drink, maybe? Anything? Anything at all? Wait. Y you're not gonna hit me? Yell at me? Not even berate me a little bit? Well, now. That's a surprise. I'm used to every asshole smooth skin in this town giving me shit just because I look like a corpse. I'm glad to see that there are a few worthwhile people around here. Listen, Moriarty'd have my head if he caught me selling at a discount. But for you, I'll risk it. Sig Signal's been shit lately. My, my. Just when I'd all but given up hope. My... Dear girl, I am very happy to make your acquaintance. I am Mr. Burke. And you, well, you are not a resident of this putrescent cesspool. That makes you a rather valuable individual. Sorry about that guys, I'm having some mic difficulties. Finally, someone with a modicum of civility and common sense. I remember. present certain right, interests, <laughs> and those interests in this town is, like a ton, as a blight on a burgeoning urban landscape. You have no connections here, no interest in this cesspool's affairs or fate. You could assist us in erasing this little accident off the map. The undetonated atomic bomb for which this town is named is still very much alive. All it needs is a little <laughs> motivation. I have in my possession a fusion pulse charge constructed for a singular purpose. The detonation of that bomb. You'll rig it to the bomb, then you'll get paid handsomely. What do you say? I say all right. Well played. An extra 500 caps, in addition to the base fee when Megaton lies in ruins. Here's the fusion pulse charge. Place it in the bomb. When it's done, meet me at Tenpenny Tower. It's southwest of here, well out of harm's way. You can't miss it. Any questions? Don't let me. A traveler, eh? Huh. I guess I'll blow up Megaton. Honestly, I hate most of the quests in this town. They're pretty cancerous. Not gonna lie. Got my eye on you. Don't do anything stupid. He said what? Oh, I never did like to look at... Jesus, give me that thing. Let's go find this Burke character. I'm pretty sure if you tell... Biggest Sims, I can end up getting his AK. Uh, because... Burke is gonna be able to kill him. With his strong pistol. Pretty much has a deliver from like Fallout 4, so. If anybody knows, a deliver in Fallout 4 is pretty OP. Pretty much play the whole game with it. You there, Burke, explain your business in Megaton. 
I'm sorry. Sheriff, what are you hollering about? You know damn well like what I'm that. talking about. The bomb. You're trying to blow it up. Have you lost your goddamn mind? Sheriff, I'm afraid there's been a <laughs> misunderstanding. Someone has surely been spreading rumors. I'll be sure to address the situation. Come on, Kelly Lucas Sims. You got this. I'm placing you under arrest, Burke. At least until I figure out what the hell's going on around here. And I'm afraid I won't be able to oblige your request, Sheriff. I have pressing matters to attend to. Now, step aside. This isn't open to discussion. Get him. coming with me. Why do you knuckle-draggers always insist on doing things the hard way? Very well, Sheriff. Got Lead the way. Mind. Looking pretty. That will cost you. I know, I know. <laughs> Good riddance. You've made a grievous error in judgment. Watch your back. It's just got you. Blood is so hard to get out of the floor. Yeah, look at that. Right. You know, it sucks losing Lucas Sims, but you gotta do what you gotta do. You got a Chinese assault rifle at the start of the game, so it's pretty. Good to see you. Oh, I guess that's good. <sighs> okay. Come on, Lucas. <laughs> oh my God! Come on. Welcome to Moriarty. What are you doing? I got nobody even reacts that the sheriff just got killed. That's good enough. A traveler, eh? Yeah, I'm a traveler. I don't recognize you. New in town or something? I hope by something to do you mean a job. Otherwise you want to talk with Nova. I'm looking for someone to make a delivery. Interested? Yeah, sure. Why not? Great. I'd like you to deliver this message to my family in the Aravu settlement. I haven't heard from them in months, and I'm worried. As soon as you get there, talk to Davis West. He'll be glad to pay you for the trip. Sure. Be glad to, since you're doing me a big favor and all. Arafu is northwest of Megaton, on an old overpass over the Potomac. If you follow what's left of the river, you can't miss it. You want um... I can't remember if I can still blow up Megaton or not. I don't think so. I urge you, my friend. Uh, I guess I have to get 25 yes. explosive. I already knew that. Alright, let's go fix the pipes in Megaton. Yeah, what is it? Well, it's no secret that the old water treatment plant is on its last legs. And I'm the only one in town that can keep the damn thing running. I spend so much time up in the plant that I can't take care of the leaks that keep springing up in the pipes around town. Now, I don't expect much from strangers. But if you've got the know-how, I need someone to hunt down and repair those leaks. From the pressure in the plant, my guess is that there are three of them scattered around town. Check along the pipes and the valves, but they might be a bit tricky to spot. I oh. All right, cool. Got you, old man. Okay. Oh, don't fall, don't fall. Jesus, come on. What's going on here? Pressing. Oh my god, that was atrocious. Good to see you.
Just atrocious. I still have the kid's ball cap on from when I was like 12. I've been wearing it ever since I was 12. Never took it off. And they wonder why I'm... I don't really know where I was going with that. You looking to trade, stranger? I'm not looking to trade. Uh, huh? Yeah, what is it? Well, I'll be. The pressure's up in the plant. It looks like all the leaks have been fixed. Thank you, stranger. Thank you. But listen, it's only a matter of time before they burst again. And someone like you might not be around to fix them. I'll make you a deal. I'll give you caps for any scrap metal you can bring me. You'll find it all over the place out there in the waste. If I have a steady supply of scrap, I can keep the plant running and the pipe should be just fine. We got a deal? Uh, sure. Good. This just keeps looking better. Those parts will keep this place running and the town in fresh water. Hurry back as soon as you find some. Twenty-five. Uh. <coughs> Still gonna go with Daddy's girl. Just finish that one up. Okay, what was I gonna do? Yeah, bombs. Go check that out. If I can blow up Megaton still or not? I don't know. Your bodies. I can. Ah. Oh. Alright, whatever. Oh, but if I disarm it. Oh, man. I screwed the pooch on this one, boys. If I disarm it, I'm not even going to get paid for it. Ah. Uh, Alright. Ah, man, that sucks. That really blows. Oh, look. Another one of your pampered vault assholes. Look here, vault asshole. I don't like you. Stay clear of me and we'll have no trouble. There ain't much to tell. I used to live out in the wastes. I was a real bastard back then. But I've put all that behind me. What? Back out where? I left all that behind me. There's nothing but bullshit out there. Killing, stealing, violence. I'm not that guy anymore. You know, I do miss it sometimes. It's a life of freedom, you know? But come on, I'm a washed up old raider. I don't know if I can what take Jericho take with me because my intelligence nothing about might be too respect. high. No offense, kid. Yeah, but you're that's not what I exactly figured. the type I'm used to running with. Now I've heard about you. A little goody two shoes out of the vault. I don't think our styles would really mesh. Nah, it ain't so bad here. I got some good memories, but that's all I got. No sense in ruining the good ones, you know? No offense. Ah, oh, man, I'm not gonna be able to take him. Oh, my karma is too high. I need to be more of an evil person. Alright. Well, that's Megaton. Not the best city, but Megaton. <coughs> Welcome to Megaton. Alright, I need to make some money here. Welcome, welcome. My name is Crow, and I travel the land offering vestments awesome of protection. Stuff. And you are fortunate I found you in time. You bear the look of one who is haunted. But I am proud to say that my wares can protect you from even the cruel claws of death itself. Have a look. 
Have a look. See if anything calls out to you. Man, look at all these freaking vault suits. Jesus. Ah, uh, okay, I guess it's Tim Kayak. This is important. Uh, that's good. I don't need those. I don't have that perk. I think that's only... There's a perk called Four Eyes, but I think it's only on New Vegas. Another satisfied customer. 68 bucks? Alright. <coughs> Seems pretty legit. That is what Megaton looks like Borderlands in there. Borderlands one. Oh Jesus. Oh guacamole. Oh God. Oh boy. There's like ten more rats back here. It's so annoying. Taking shots. Okay, right. the hollow rock back here. Sniper rifle and stuff. Just chilling, taking my bullets. Uh, I'm running out of bullets, that's for sure. Uh, let's see where we're gonna head now. I think I'm gonna head to Ten Penny Tower. God, my character looks so lame. Let's change up uh, Sheriff's hat. There we go. Oh, it's not any better, but whatever. Oh my God. Oh God. This is not good. This dog is eating bullets. Oh my god. Oh my god. My aim is so bad. Jesus. I'm not gonna have any ammo. God. That was terrible. Nobody saw that. That was terrible. I need to make hotkeys. Uh, <coughs> I don't want to have a broken sniper rifle. That, that'd be the worst. Stim pack. Bottom. I guess I should take a stim pack now. I wish Fallout 3 and New Vegas had mods. That'd be pretty cool. I thought they were gonna add mods for New Vegas. I don't know, that's what the internet was saying. On like Reddit and stuff, but... I guess that, th oh, these guys have like rocket launchers. And there's actually a turret right there, too. I'm not messing with that. Oh, that's going to be some good loot, though. Oh, man. 
so tempting. So tempting. Ah, oh, screw it, I'll do it. Go for the boys. The hawk. Oh my god, I just used a stim pack. <sighs> Trying to grab the frag grenade. The hotkey is like broken. <coughs> oh my god, he has like a flamethrower. Oh my god. As long as he didn't have a bolt action rifle, I'm not scared of him. Fuck <laughs> me! Wait, what? Did that really just happen? Oh man. What is going on? Wow, those are the worst grenades I've ever thrown in my life. Oh my god, they're so strong. My god. That's so AIDS. Like, what the hell? Oh my god. And uh, he's just using it. Oh my god. No, dude. Why do you have to whip out the freaking flamethrower? I'm out of ammo. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. What is happening? Alright, I'm just gonna charge him. God, what, what just happened there? What was that? That was terrible. Oh, I have no ammo in anything. I'm screwed more than Scrooge. Where are the people? I don't care about the machine gun up there. Oh my god! What is happening here? I swear to god I'm not a noob. I've played this game for so long. I'm a bit rusty. Yeah, they're on the other side. And I can't even hack this. Uh, I'm just gonna need to turn it live. I don't even care. got to take two shots on me before you died get a 32 couldn't have a 44 magnum we had to have a 32 one of the worst guns in the game just die from his own landmine all right oh my god are you kidding me I'm having the worst luck right now. Like, this is so terrible. Ah, just the worst luck. That's the way she goes sometimes though. Oh my god. Okay, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I am so out. I need to blow this car up or I'm screwed. Oh my god, why is it not blowing up? That should have blown it up. Or caught on fire. Oh my god. I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of here. Oh my god. No, they're chasing me. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. What's going on here? Is this the outcast? Head down, idiot. Raider incoming. I know those raiders incoming, man. They're freaking chasing me. Well, there's more where that came from. Ah. 
guy's got a sawed off. <laughs> I'm just whooping him with a baseball bat as he's getting shot by lasers. Didn't a raider just die right here? Oh, ammo. Thank God. Six rounds. Yeah. Thank God. Are they killing my friends that followed me? Alright. I'm not even gonna mess with them. What is over here now? Oh my god. Boat flies? Bot flies? This is just the worst. Jeepers. Ah. Oh my god, I'm so dead. I better have a stim pack. It's my last stim pack. There's more. First idea was going to that town. I don't know why I went to that town. That was really dumb. Oh, I have another stim pack. I thought it was my last one. Why is he running away? Screw this. I don't even want to fight. Like, Jesus. Now he wants to fight? What's going on here? Oh, this is his friend. Are you kidding me? They just run away. <coughs> you gotta kill them in vat vats or they just fly right away. Are you kidding me right now? I don't even want to, if I run into a Yagoya or whatever the bear is, I'm so screwed. There's a Yagoy. I don't know what it is, like a Chinese bear. There's Tenpenny Tower. Gotta get there. I gotta get. Oh my. Oh, yeah. I thought it was the Yagoy. What? Where's this guy? What the hell? His friends are following me. Please be a critical. Yes. Boom. Out to the fields. Get over here. And then he's gonna run away when he's almost dead. All right. I'll mess with you later. What was that? I always thought the wasteland was less dangerous, but it's like, super dangerous. Yeah, this is worse than Fallout 4. Like, Fallout 4, you can just run right through. Well, unless you're on survival mode. And there's, like, way more ammo on Fallout 4. Like, you never have to worry about running out of ammo. And if you run out of ammo, you just use melee weapons. Melee weapons are, like, the strongest thing in Fallout 4. Oh, it's ten penny shooting people. Sniper, that's what... I'm just blowing people up. Sniper. Where's the entrance? I'm pretty sure it's right here. I had another stim pack. God. You can tell Tenpenny he can kiss my ass. 
We've got plenty of bottle caps. Let me in, goddammit. How many times do we have to go through this? You're not getting in. I can stand here all day yelling at you through this damn speaker if I have to. I've already told you Tenpenny won't allow zombies to live here. Who the zombies. hell are you calling a zombie? You're definitely not human, that's for damn sure. For the last time, no zombies allowed. Can't you tell the difference between me and a feral? Fine. I'll show you the goddamn difference. Just you wait. You'll get yours, all of you. What are you looking at? Nah, he's pissed. I, I told you to get the hell out of here. Tenpenny doesn't want your goddamn caps. And I don't want the goddamn headache. For the last time, get your rotten, ugly, goddamn ghoul ass off Mr. Tenpenny's private property. What? No, just those damn ghouls. Sorry, thought you were one of them. Ghoul or not, I must inform you that you are trespassing on Alistair Tenpenny's private property. Renders an official business only. Is that so? And why should I believe that? You ever kill a ghoul before? Is that so? Then I'm sure you can handle yourself out there in the wasteland just fine. Are you done wasting my time? Oh man, let me in. Ah, oh, I gotta give this guy a hundred bucks. Are you serious? Right, guys this is gonna be the end of my uh second playthrough video i uh, hope you guys enjoy it like comment subscribe and leave some feedback it'll be much appreciated thanks